ko uh, Tōpuru Ariki Brightwell tuku ingoa, uh, no Turanga Nui uh, Kiwa O, um, ko Ngāti Puro Te Iwi, uh, ko Te Whanau Rua Taupare Te Hapu, um, to Tahao Toku Mama no Tahiti. Kia ora everyone, my name is uh, Tōpuru Ariki, people call me Ariki. Um, I'm originally from Gisborne, and my main tribe is Ngāti Puro, and um, sub-tribe is Te Whanau Rua Taupare. Uh, my father's side. On my mother's side, um, I come from Tahiti. I've um, been fortunate to be one of the artists selected to be a part of the Hipakinga Tonga project. And so the story is given to me. Uh, the first one, which I'm working on now, is uh, called Ruhia's Cloak. And the second one is uh, Huria Martinga. It's about a woman who saved a group of Europeans um, out at sea. As soon as I came into this world, I was always fascinated and always had an interest in creativity and my parents always encouraged me. And so um, as, from as long as I can remember, uh, I've always been drawing. And I was always that student at school that wouldn't pay too much attention to the, the writing stuff, um, who always be sketching in their sketchbook. My style has changed uh, drastically over the years. Um, so first my style resembled a lot of the Japanese artwork and animation, because uh, that was my, I, was a, I, I loved that stuff. Now I started to incorporate my own style, which is a mixture of Eastern and Western, um, which has been amalgamated with traditional aspects, um, hence my, my style of the red, white and black, um, but it's got that comic book kind of graphic feel to it. So I've kind of mushed those all together and um, I really do call that my own style now. Yeah. Working in animation, uh, the scene I'm working on right now uh, is one of the last scenes of the story. Each person or object within the image needs to be its own separate um, layer. Um, and so with those pieces, um, the, the animator for the project will then take those assets and make them move um, and cause the illusion of movement. I just like to illustrate um, our stories, our people, and uh, show them to the world. Because that's what our ancestors did, was depict their stories through the arch. Um, and so I'm doing that as well, but more in the modern sense. 